Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick, and so everybody decided to mow when I tried to make this video, but it's not like I can play the game anyway because it, it my power is out. We had a really bad storm, and so the power is out. Um, I'm actually outside here, as you can see. Um, I'm out in like my screen bin porch or like patio area. Um, doing this video because I need light uh, and since I can't turn on any lights because the power is out um, well I can't get this to look straight uh, whatever um, since the power is out I decided to do it out here um, but what I'm doing is the uh, opening or whatever of the collector's edition of Sniper Elite 3 I did take the sticky stuff off on both ends already so I could easily open it and so let's get into this I actually haven't even looked at it so this comes off uh, to leave this like the ammo box, but on the back you can see uh, pretty much just like any other, um, you know, outside of a box, I guess. So let's open this. Let's see here. Is there anything special? Uh, no, it says Sniper Elite 3 on the sides. And yeah, on both sides and then on the top, of course. So let's pop this open. Got some pretty cool things. Right here is a uh, sharpshooter. Target series, uh, I think it's just, yeah, it's just, um, uh, targets, uh, paper targets that you could shoot. Uh, right here are some playing cards. I don't really want to open up, open them up, um, but they're probably pretty darn cool, but I kind of want to keep them sealed. Uh, they look pretty cool. Sorry, I needed a drink. I'll get into that next. Uh, right here I got some dog tags. Uh, I think just Sniper Elite dog tags. I'll open this up. Let's see here. Yeah, so Sniper Elite dog tag right here. Oh, sorry guys. Uh, allergies. Uh, and then right here, Carl Fairburn one shot change history. Let's see if I can get it up there. I'm trying to get the light. Um, and then it's just kind of the. It's raised on this side. And then that's the end on that side right there. So next I got all these DLCs. Uh, so I've got the DLC Hunter Pack, Camel Pack, and Outfit Pack. I'm not entirely sure what these are. Uh, obviously not going to flip them over because the codes are on the back. But have those. Also got some other cool things. Uh, just I think from pre-order. Uh, you got a DLC and a couple other things. Or maybe that was what the click. I don't know. Uh, right here is for keychain. Uh, it's a sniper elite bullet. It's a sniper bullet. Uh, pretty cool, uh, in my opinion. Oh, it's a flashlight. Look at that. Look at that. That's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. Let's see here. Does it have any other features? Like, oh my gosh, it's a pen. Oh my gosh. All right, this is pretty cool. I might actually have to put this on my keychain because it's kind of cool. So it's a flashlight. It's cool because it's a bullet. And it's also a pen. So that's pretty sweet. Alright, so next, obviously, is the game. So I'm actually uh, going to open this up and see if what I get inside of the game. Got to get all this stupid plastic wrap off. See what you get with just the regular game. If you don't get the collector's edition, if there's any codes or anything inside of it. Alright, that, come on, come on, there we go, alrighty, now just to take the seal off, I've been waiting for this game, it's one of the only games that comes out this summer, so I was really looking forward to it, alright, so here it is, the inside, there's the, there's the disc, I think the back, yeah, the back is the exact same as this back, uh, just this one's a little smaller because it's the game. Any codes or anything? No, this is just the uh, instruction manual. As you can see, got it for the Xbox One. I mean, probably maybe the coolest part. I don't know. I haven't looked at it yet. Uh, this is top secret uh, OSS operation um, from November the f or de December the fifth, uh, 1942. Kept under lock and key. I'm gonna pop this open. It's gotta have some cool stuff in it. Alrighty, so it's got maps. So that's pretty cool. It's got some cool maps in here. 
uh, I think just showing, I, th I think it's probably, it's got to be following the game. Uh, so, let's see here. Alright, this one doesn't say where it's at. Alright, so, these are all only sold by Liberty Torch New York, but uh, this is Gabaroon, and this is Tobruk, or Tobruk, Tobruk, or whatever it is. And I don't know what this is of. Uh, here are some vehicles, uh, support your allies. Uh, this is all the tanks and stuff like that. So that's pretty cool. All the Axis and Allies, and I think these are all the planes. So there's the Allied, the Axis. So these, this is pretty cool stuff. Are these postcards of some sort? Yeah, these are these are postcards, um, which are pretty darn cool. This is cool. I'm happy I got this. It was only ten bucks extra uh, for all of this, so that's pretty cool. Uh, these, this is uh, gun schematics, I think. Yeah, here we go. This is sniper and pistol. This is an M1 Grand, um, and I don't know what the pistol is. But that's pretty cool. There's a gun schematics. Here's the Tiger Panzer tank schematics. So that's pretty cool. Uh, let's see here. What is this? This is the Axis Armored uh, tank. The Tiger Rate or Rat or whatever it is tank. So that's pretty cool. Let's see here. Is this another? Oh, no. Let's go that last. All right. We got a note. So let me. I'll read the note. I was told to keep a journal or to write to someone back home to help keep my thoughts in order. Here goes. Before you've even fired a gun or had a bullet, whiz by its the heat that gets you no matter how much you try and shut it out it's a dry blazing force of the sun that punches through the shell first and once that's cracked the smell hits you uh that of the acrid smoke the rotting corpses i never bothered shutting them out i let them in and moved on each day rolls on like the last and every dead face bears the same empty expression. In the end, it's always them or me. Carl. So Carl must be the main character. Uh, and then this looks pretty cool. What is this? It's like a poster, I think, or something? I don't know. Like an advertisement? Isis, the Queen of Cairo. Uh, pretty cool. Um, advertisement for like an Egyptian girl. Like, I don't know. Um, is she like a dancer? I think she's got to be like a dancer or like a stripper or something. I don't know, because it's, it's, it's at the Joffers Club Tobruk on June 21st of 1942. And it, you can see it's canceled, so I don't know what it is. Is she like a hooker or something? But uh, that is some pretty cool stuff. Um, I'm really happy I bought this for the whole, like, um... Ten dollars extra it was actually like nine dollars extra, and I almost traded in a couple games, so it would have been like less. Um, but I didn't. I'm saving my trade ins for Madden, so I can get Madden for free. I think, or or maybe I might even save them for longer than that. But they depreciate in value, so it should be interesting. Uh, but I hope you guys enjoyed this. Let me know if you guys got the collector's edition of Sniper Elite Three, or if you even got the game. Also, uh, this is Carl, I believe. Hopefully, um, this is inside the box. Um, just kind of cool picture. Um, I don't know what I'm going to use this box for. It's a really cool box. Uh, it's like a bullet cartridge uh, box, ammo box. Uh, so I don't know exactly what I'm going to do with it. I'll figure out uh, something. I uh, might put all my football tickets and basketball tickets and hockey and soccer and baseball and all those tickets into that box. I don't know. I have them in an all-air box right now. I actually don't know if this box is big enough. Some of the tickets might be too big for the box. So I'll have to see. Uh, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Drop a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't. I'll catch you guys in my next video. Peace out, guys.